High school sports are back. Isn't that really refreshing to hear? And that means that North Andover girls basketball is back in session two in the new high school COVID normal. Unfortunately though, the results were not in their favor tonight after dropping their second game of the season to Tewksbury, 58 to 50. Offensively, the Knights struggled out of the gate, only scoring five points in the first quarter, while Tewksbury piled on 17 points. However, the Knights exploded for 19 points in the second quarter and really broke through Tewksbury's full court press that they had been implementing all first half. But Tewksbury kept on scoring, extending their lead to 35 to 24 at the half. The third quarter saw the Knights making a valiant comeback, at one point getting within three points of Tewksbury. The junior captain, Katie Roby, was a big part of that comeback, scoring seven of her 18 points in the third. But Tewksbury held strong finishing the third with an eight point lead and holding the Knights to just eight points in the fourth quarter to solidify their 58 to 50 win. Tewksbury saw their captain Lexi Palomino come through when it mattered most, scoring six of her 15 points in the fourth quarter. For the Knights, sophomore sensation Hannah Martin chipped in 11 points in her second season with the squad, while Jackie Rogers chipped in 10 points as well, scoring six of North Andover's eight fourth quarter points. With last year's star-studded senior class, a memory for the Knights, I asked Coach Jess Devini about the young roster that she has in her third season as head coach for the Knights. First and foremost, I got two really great senior captains, Katrina Garcia and Solana Fahey. So they're really the, the, the anchor of our team, right? And we have another captain, our junior, Katie Roby. So those three have been on varsity for my three years that uh, being here at North Andover. I have uh, some sophomores that really have wonderful potential, have really shown a lot of great skills early in their basketball career. And I have one freshman, Janie Papel, who um, has come in and, uh, you know, made the soccer team, made the basketball team. She's a great athlete and has a really great head on her shoulders, stays very humble, and, and that's admirable in itself. And what is also the COVID season for high school sports, with players and coaches wearing masks at all time and socially distant seating on the bench. I asked Davini about the challenges that she and her players will face this year. I could have never dreamt of this kind of season happening. And um, it's, it's wonderful to be able to be out here. Um, you know, not unlike so many things in our life, we've really had to adjust to the changes that COVID has brought forth. And um, the bench is one thing. I feel like I can't even talk to my whole team at once without shouting and giving anything away to the other, other team. On timeouts, we go off to the side and try and stay socially distant. Um, just the very fact that I'm not able to have my coaches from the JV and freshman team on the bench next to me, that's really difficult um, as a minute, you know. And they, they always give me great advice off the court, but I love to have them by my side in the game. We work together as a team, so I'm really missing out on that. Um, I think the girls are doing a wonderful job with wearing the masks. That It's absolutely hard. I mean, I get tired from just coaching with a mask on. I can only imagine what it's like to not be able to breathe that fresh air as you're running up and down the court. So they, they've done an absolutely wonderful job. And, and truly, the, the thing that is most important here is that we get out and get to play the game of basketball. I feel like the, the practices that we have are the, very important as we're all together and we're, we're able to do something we love doing. So um, grateful for this opportunity, but we, we don't downplay the challenges that are, we are presented with. Reporting from Crozier Gymnasium here in North Andover High School, I'm Sam Murray.